Hello everyone. So today let us continue learning Easy BI and in this video let us learn how to get the issue key. That is it. A simple thing but a useful thing, right? Because if you're looking at let us say this table where I'm showing the list of epics, it could be any table and you could be looking at any uh, level in case you have different levels like advanced roadmaps but let us say you have a table like this where you have list of some items now of course we have the list of issues here in front of us with issue key and summary but the issue key and summary they are like clubbed together and you can actually change few things you can also um, display um, either key or uh, maybe summary I think it, it uh, you, you can definitely display key, but in case you want to separately display key, apart from of course this default key and summary, uh, you can also write your own uh, uh, your, your own uh, measure. So let us do that. So I'll click on the define new calculated measure. I'll I'll name it as issue key and. Uh, you can actually uh, learn a lot of things by just experimenting. So what you need to do, just type in here issue. That is it, right? Because we are trying to get something from the issue. Create. Okay, we are not done yet, but uh, just just play with it. So if you click on issue key, it will display something here, like the count of issues under this, this, this level in the hierarchy. You can try something like uh, dot name and uh, click on the update it will then display issue because that is the name of the uh, measure but what we want to do is we want to use something like uh, current member current hierarchy or current hierarchy member so basically when you're working with uh, hierarchy you can use something like current hierarchy member so if we do this uh, let, us, let us let us first click on the update so it will of course display still the count but uh, because we have current hierarchy member, you can do something like uh, maybe let, let us type here key, right? And click on the update button. So it will display the key here for you. And uh, uh, this key, of course, is basically the same key which we have uh, for that particular epic. But it is not really the epic. It is basically the, I mean, it is the epic, but it is the level. Because if you expand this uh, AN294, you have all the stories and you have for each and every story their individual uh, their individual uh, key you you may have subtask and you can see here for the subtask as well so this is quite useful because in case you are exporting it to some sheet or csv uh, then you need a key right because key is everything all right <laughs> that is it yeah simple video but I will definitely create more videos, similar videos, showing you things that you can do with EasyBI. When it comes to EasyBI, of course, uh, MDX will take your Easy EasyBI skills to the next level. All right, that is it. Bye bye.